Hi, welcome back to Arts and Crafts with Miss Vicki. Today our story was so much fun. It was about a wedding. Everybody loves to celebrate a wedding and I thought that it would be really fun to make wedding cookies, but it was just too hot. My husband said, you can't turn on the oven. So I put on my thinking cap and I thought that maybe we could do some rock art of somebody celebrating life. So that's what we're gonna do today. You can use all kinds of media for this. Media is just the things we put it on. This is a piece of cardboard with just a piece of construction paper on it. That would work. I've got this, and this is a piece of cardboard, and I found some blue uh, wrapping paper in with uh, some of my other stuff, and that's gonna work too. I've got this black uh, tissue paper. You can use something like that or a different color, whatever you want, but you know how Miss Vicki loves paint. I thought I was gonna take my piece of cardboard and I'm going to paint a night sky on it. So I'm gonna take first my blue paint, put some down, I'll need a bunch, and then to make it a midnight blue, I'm going to put a bit of black in with that, okay? So let's get our paintbrush and blend those two colors together. Ooh, pretty, pretty, pretty midnight blue sky. All right, here it's mixing up. So we're gonna take, now I'm just gonna paint the whole thing And then as soon as I'm done painting this, I'm gonna to have to let it dry. So I'm gonna finish painting this, then I'm gonna let it dry, and then I'll be back with you in just a second. Okay, my picture is dry, and if you see, I decided to put some stars in the sky in my picture, and I'll tell you how I did that. I took some white paint and added a little bit of water to it to thin it down. Then I took my old toothbrush, and I dipped it in the paint, and I held it up over the top, put a piece of paper here so it wouldn't go down any lower than I wanted it to go, and then you just go like this and sprinkle um, stars on your picture. So we are going to start with our rock art. I took my handy dandy basket outside earlier and I collected all of these rocks out of my yard. Now if you don't have rocks in your yard and your neighbor does and you decide to borrow some, Ask your neighbor first to make sure it's okay. All right, so I'm going to make, on my celebration, there's nothing better to celebrate with than balloons. So I'm going to make somebody standing on a rock. I need some leg pieces. Let's see, here's a leg, here's a leg, standing on a rock. I'm going to switch that one over there, put this one here. All right, I'm going to give him a head. Let's see, a nice pretty round head. Here, let's do this one for their head. I need a couple of little ones for their arms. Let's see what I've got. Let's see, here's a couple that might work for arms. He's going to be holding up some balloons from here and the other arm is gonna come down here. And now we're gonna do our balloons. Now I need some nice pretty round ones. So I've collected quite a few nice round rocks. So I'm just gonna start putting, oh, different rocks at different heights. Here we go, let's see, here's a nice one. And here's a nice one. And then one more nice round balloon. Now if you want, you can take your black marker, which I left right over here. And if you know this is where you want it to go, you can take and you can draw strings up to them. It doesn't show very much, but it does show a little bit with this perma marker. As you can see, I'm going up and up and up and up. And I've connected my balloons together with that line in the night sky. 
I also decided on my picture that I would like to do a dog. So I'm gonna put this down for his body. He needs a couple of little legs. He's got little short legs and a long tail. I like that. And he needs a head. Here's a rock that's kind of got a, a, a nice shape to it. I got a dog. And then I'm gonna put a tree on my picture. I'm just gonna put this right here. And I'm gonna take my rocks and put rocks going out like this to make it look like it's a tree. Let's see, here's some more here, some more here. You use whatever kind of rocks you want that you found. And here we have here, maybe another one here. Let's see what I got here, here. Okay, here's a nice one. I like that, I like that one. Just do whatever you want, whatever looks good, whatever, whatever you want. I'm almost done with my picture. The last thing that I'm going to put in my picture is a big moon right up here in the corner of my picture. What a fun way to celebrate. Now, what I'm going to do right now is I'm gonna take my hot glue gun and I'm going to start using my hot glue gun to put these things down on my picture. Give it a few shots it down and I'm going to do that with every single one of my rocks and then I'll have a great picture. Do not use a hot glue gun without an adult with you because hot means super hot and it can burn your skin. So be very, very careful. Now if you don't have the cardboard and the paint and you don't want to make a picture, you can always just Take your rocks outside on the sidewalk and make a beautiful picture for you and your friends and your neighbors to enjoy. And you can do anything you want. You can do people, cars, trucks, bicycles, whatever you want. Just have fun with this project. All right, kids, that's it for today. I hope you enjoyed this. I hope you have fun with this art project. I'll see you later. I love you bunches. Bye.